Come here! Yo! Come back here! Yes! Whoa, man! That was an amazing play! Wow! This is Star Ocean, and it's, uh, it's pretty awesome. Hello, and welcome to another Nihongo Gamer video. Time to play Star Ocean Integrity and Faithlessness. I don't... It's called Star Ocean 5. I actually don't know if I'm supposed to play 1, 2, 3, and 4 before I play this one, but I'm hoping not. Press the Options button. It really bugs me that there's no Start button, but, you know... I'm sure I'll get used to that one day. Earth mode wa so shoshin sha Well, okay, so Earth mode is for beginners and Galaxy mode is for people who uh, kind of want to do it a little more difficult. It says uh, for, you know, basically standard. I think maybe Galaxy is more standard to difficult and Earth is just, it's actually been made easier for beginners. Star Mura. Welcome to Star Village. Check out the graphics. Gotta love a little bit of a 60 FPS gameplay. I'm having a real, real uh, throwback to that game with the uh, Xenoblade. I'm having a real throwback to Xenoblade Chronicles here. I don't know if any of the stuff are shared or similar. They might be, they might not be. Actually, Xenoblade, that's monolith, it's not Square Enix. Battle tutorial, how do you mean Would you like to watch a battle tutorial? Sure, love tutorials. Uh, use the left stick. Ah, this is the classic JRPG thing. It's not really a tutorial. It's gonna be a big page I may as well still have a paper manual. It's telling me that uh, If I move around and I press the cross button and then I dash I press the square button and then I can walk That's interesting. Okay, so square button and cross button. Let's try that R3 button uh, to move the characters field up and down Oh wow, this is just so classic JRPG. They're giving me like 700 things to remember at the same time. In the middle of battles, press the circle button and the X button uh, shortly to do different attacks. Oh, this is terrible. This is, oh, classic Japan. Thanks for nothing. Okay, so essentially there were directions, but we didn't read all of them. I'm pressing up and down. It's not doing much here because I think that's for field only. Cross is my standard... Ooh! Check it out! I did a two-hit combo just by pressing it pressing it once. Uh, if I press circle, I've got another two-hit combo. Maybe if I... If I... Yeah, I can... Yeah, I think I can stick... Link combos together by pressing cross and circle. Battle to two... Um, what is this? Square button, press the guard. Ooh! I can guard by pressing square. Let's try that. Didn't work. Ooh! Yeah, okay, you gotta do it in time. It didn't work. Uh, okay, press the circle button and the square button for a long time. Ouch. There we go. I got... I think maybe if you... When, this, when you press the second button in your combo, holding it down for a long time will... I, I don't know. I'll do something a little bit different. <laughs> Let's walk around town, he said. Sure. It's like a date with a man. I'm up. I'm up for. Uh, I'm up for anything. I, I guess. <laughs> Don't even know what planet I'm on. He's like, uh, haven't seen you for five years. You've really changed. Something like there's lots of monsters nowadays. Or. Ooh. I love that I can move the camera around while people are talking. If they're saying anything boring, I can just move around. I'm very grateful that there is voice acting though, it makes it much, much easier to read read the, the kanji. Unfortunately, I wasn't paying attention, so I don't, I don't know. But uh, I was. I do want to read. I'm really, I am quite keen to find out what's going on in this game. So let's run around with our friend, whose name I've already forgotten. Uh, oh, just earlier. Oh, yes, the uh, Fidel. Oh, th that Fidel, eh? Oh, something about... Uh, it can't be Fidel. I guess Fidel, I think Fidel is maybe the character that I'm running around now as with the with the blue hair. I pressed triangle and that has opened up my menu. I don't have any jump button. I always, I, I always feel like in an RPG you should have a jump button, which is why the Atelier series is so wonderful. This character looks like, I don't know if it's a child or if it's just another race of, of short, shorter, shorter than average human size. I love it. Look at this. You can see everyone's got little thoughts going above their head just as you walk past them. That's really nice because you can get a quick feel for what they're saying without actually speaking to them. 
Oh, this is classic. You see this um, actually in Japan. I've seen this uh, not recently, but I saw it last year where they, uh, they slice the fish in half and they leave them on these grids. This is proof that in the future, Japanese tradition still lives on and always will because stubbornness is hard to hard to kill off. Okay. Nah, that's 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 harsh. It's not just stubbornness. Tradition tradition is important. <laughs> I don't uh, remember where he said we we're supposed to go, but I'm just going for a little explore at the moment. Ah, looks like those red marks are either exits or places that we are supposed to visit. Let's try visiting this place, but it won't let us. Can I talk to, can I talk to my friend? Hey, hey you, talk to me. I can't talk to him. Let's try going up, but that's where we came from. Oh no, no, we came from down there. We're going up here now to the, uh, the place with- Whoa! I mean, I don't know how much effort went into the- <laughs> Look at these two people! We are such a couple, we are literally Siamese twin. Uh, whoa, 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 look at the way they move! That's amazing! <laughs> that was really, that was really interesting. They were like, completely linked. Um, great. Uh, today is hot. Yes, it is hot. Where are we supposed to go? Let's try going uh, this way to the main town looking bit. Can we go in here? Oh! Hey, is, isn't that... Isn't that Miki? She's like, is she? Uh, <laughs> okay, so it's, it's hard to translate as they're speaking, but one of them's like, "Oh, isn't that Miki? She's uh, she's 18 now, isn't she? She's uh, she's become quite the adult." And uh, Fidel was a bit like, um, uh, "She's the same age as my sister, so I can't really think of her in that way because uh, my sister is 18 as well." What evs? Oh, I've been forced to walk as I get closer to her. I think I saw. Uh, I think I saw someone, the shape of a human over there. There's a, there's a shadow over there. Oh, yes there is. This is amazing that I have full control over the camera while all this is happening. He's like, that looks kind of suspicious. They're not from Star. She's like, what should we do? What should we do? We need to tell the mayor. Is it okay to just leave them there? I think the guy with the red hair is kind of like, is it okay to just leave them there? And the guy with the blue hair is like, we need to be diplomatic and uh, we don't want to like m make a mistake or do anything wrong. So they're not uh, letting us go in there. But I think this place with the star is probably where the mayor lives. Let's go tell the mayor about the the crazy people. The not Fidel. The infidel. I guess. I guess that's one way to, to think about it. Um now loading. You must be the mayor. I don't really know why you let us in here with a sword, but Is it true what you saw? What are they? Eitarons? Uh, what was that about? Um, I think some people came and attacked the town five years ago and these look like the same kind of people. It's impossible! Uh, the mayor's like, what do I do? I don't know what to do. <laughs> he's like, he's like, Mayor, chill out. <laughs> Don't panic. But you can see what kind of mayor he is, because look. He's like sitting at a table by himself with like nothing going on apart from bottles and bottles of wine. Fidel. I'm I'm asking I'm I'm begging you, do me a favor, Fidel. Do something about it. Yes, I'll use all my strength to do do something about it. <laughs> Great. Well, clearly I'm the hero. Now loading. Now loading. You can do it. You can do it. Wow, we've like completely set up a barricade for those two people. We are really over panicking. 
I mean, especially when you've got a hero like me <laughs> nearby, no need to worry. So, am I supposed to go over there and greet them, or what? I'm not 100% sure. I didn't do any um, preparation either. And I don't see... I press options to open up that map. I see a load option, but I don't see a save option. Maybe it's in settings. Maybe it's in load. Oh! I clicked load. Okay, no, it's like, there's no save data. He's like, we don't know when they're gonna come, but we just have to wait. He's like, what if they don't come? And the guy with the blue hair is like, isn't that better if they don't come? Um, oh! I think they were talking about what what we should possibly do about this situation and then while they were talking these these guys came in and whoa I need to fight you no oh, I was pressing the wrong button I was pressing square come here you come back here yes I'm the best this is a wicked wicked battle system you are gonna love this this is brilliant I feel really, like, really strong as well. I don't know who's on my side. The ones that say target are probably the enemies, huh? I'm hoping that I can't hurt my own friends, but there's no guarantee. Essentially what I'm doing is sometimes pressing the button and sometimes holding the button down, and it looks like that Mickey girl is coming over. She has got magic, apparently. That is the role of women in video games, to be the magic users. <laughs> it's not true. Um, plenty of... Plenty of female heroes in video games now. Fortunately. I am loving this battle system. It is so much fun. And if I may say so, quite a bit more fun than Xenoblade. Xenoblade was a bit slow and like, I felt disembodied, like I didn't have control of the character properly. But in this game, I feel like I have proper control. Uh, he's like, there's there's people that you need to protect. Go and watch over the uh, go and watch over the the mayor or something. It's really dark. I don't know if you can even see, but the, this video game, it's not just my my uh, game capture device. I think it's just <laughs> this game is really dark. You know, just double check that there's no one coming from over here. Looks looks safe. I can't say that this is really the best barricade ever built, but we definitely don't need to go that direction. I'm thinking that I might be able to run if I hold down, yes, if I hold down cross, which I'm not a fan of because holding cross means I don't have, oh, they broke into the town and they're, they're still fighting. Come here. Yeah, that was my circle, that was my circle on holding down the cross button combo. Dang, dang, this game's good. Just pretending to sound like other YouTubers, I, I realize I have a very non-regional accent, but uh, I like to pretend that I, I sound like other, other YouTubers sometimes. Whoa, man, that was an amazing play! Wow! Crikes! <laughs> crikes, actually, they wouldn't have said crikes. I'm probably the only one still saying crikes. So, I'm doing a few circle attacks, cross attacks. Fortunately, because the early, it, you know, it's this early in the game, it's fine to, to button bash a bit. We did it! We won! And you always have complete control of the ca camera, which is wonderful. So this is... This is... Star Ocean. And it's, uh, it's pretty awesome. I'm really, really enjoying it. I'm hoping... Hoping that, uh, I mean, with the current pace of the game, there won't be many cuts needed for this video, because sometimes I have to cut out, like, the boring bits where literally nothing is happening. He's like, this time we were okay, but I don't know what will happen next time. And the mayor's like, next time? They're gonna come back? Please tell me it's a lie. What should we do? Have you got any idea? We just should send, um... We need to send like an escort party, or not an escort party, I don't know what to, to call it, Engun. Some sort of, we need to send some sort of investigation party um, to the other country. 
You're gonna be sad, uh, sad, not sad. Are you gonna be lonely without me here? I wish I had a way to zoom in on the camera a bit like FF14. I love that I can keep talking while moving around, that's very, very cool. Alright, well, uh, I think I will leave that there for this first gameplay video of Star Ocean 5. We had a bit of battle, had a bit of story introduction, not 100% sure what was going- Whoa, did you see that woman just walk straight through that man? Uh, the graphics are wonderful. I love this graphic style. I can see, obviously, where it could be even more detailed, but I don't think that would make the game better if it were more detailed than this. Looks really good. Very much looking forward to playing more of this game. But uh, until the next video goes up, don't forget to comment, subscribe, share the links and all that good stuff, and I will see you in the next Nihongo Gamer video. Thank you.